And you're certain that the murderer is Boyd Davis? Absolutely. No further questions, Your Honor. Let's see if the world-famous DeWitt brothers can wiggle their client out of this one. Objection! Objection sustained. Thank you, Your Honor. So, Mr. Chalmers, <laughs> you say that you saw my client, Boyd Davis, commit this murder. Unequivocally, he committed the murder. But it was over six months ago. Well, I'm a photographer, so I, I took um, multiple pictures of the murder in progress, and I captioned each one, Boyd Davis killing a man. <laughs> that Boyd Davis? Yes, that man sitting right over there with the blue suit. I saw him commit the murders. Your Honor, may I take a minute? Looks like you'd better, Counselor. <laughs> I think we're screwed. <laughs> just follow me. Let's just forget about the murder for a minute, Mr. Chalmers, and let me ask you this question. Would you rather beat up your father or make love to your mother? <laughs> Objection! Relevance? Where are you headed with this, Mr. DeWitt? If you will allow me, Judge, I am establishing character. It's an eyewitness. I'll allow it. But I'm warning you, Mr. DeWitt, you're treading on thin ice. Witness may I answer the question. Um, I wouldn't do either. May I remind you that you are under oath? <laughs> well, I, I don't want anyone to get hurt, so I... I make love to my mother. <laughs> that man's disgusting. Objection. Withdrawn. Withdrawn. The jury will disregard the last question. Okay, Mr. Mother Lover. Uh, objection. Withdrawn. Withdrawn. Mr. Chalmers, would you rather eat a bucket of worms or a cup of crap? Objection. Overruled. I want to see where this goes. Answer the question. <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't know. I, I guess a cup of crap. Ew! This diet should be on trial. Objection. Overruled. Let them ask their questions. Mr. Chalmers, so you can get back to your hot lunch. Or call your mother. I've never eaten <laughs> crap. Sir, would you rather punch a baby in the face or kick a baby in the face? Uh, there's no right answer here. You're going to have to choose, Mr. Chalmers. Oh, yeah. I, uh... Punch a baby in the face. Oh! Oh, Your Honor, please! Will you sit down? Sit down! Mr. Chalmers, if you had to make out with a man, would you rather French kiss juror number five or the judge? I'm not gay. It's a hypothetical question. If, if you are gay. Now answer the question. I, I don't know. Uh, the, the, the judge. Isn't that a lie? Wouldn't you rather have intercourse with juror number five? Hey, you said make out. Answer the question. Wouldn't you rather sodomize juror number five, who obviously works out, as opposed to an older, heavy-set judge, Mr. Chalmers? I don't know. I'm confused. You're confused or you're lying. You're I, lying, aren't you? Are you lying? I, I guess I, I am. You got, you, uh, wait, good, blah, 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 blah. what? You're what? Uh, lying. Mr. Chalmers. I don't care that you'd like to make love to your mother. And I don't care that you'd like to eat a mug of crap. And I don't care that you'd like to smack around a baby. Or perform sex on a handsome oh. dream. But what we do care about, Mr. Chalmers, is lying. Especially in a court of law. No further questions, Your Honor. But I, you know... Th Shut up! You disgust me. Not only because you're a liar, but because you judge people on their physical appearances. I happen to be a great kisser. And a very sensitive and gentle lover. Now it's my turn to rule. I'm throwing the case out. Boy, Davis, you're a free man.